but I just didn't care. He actually cranked a full night. What? There's no freaking way I get headshot. That. Yep. Howdy and hello. My name is Doe. Hope you're doing good. Arc Thor got buffed. May as well test it versus the bugs and see how it feels. I heard you can stagger chargers now. Don't quite know what that means. Because with the Hulks, you can stagger them and they can't do anything. They just sit there lost in the sauce. Stamina boost. Arc thrower. Guard dog rover. KG anti-tank. Scorcher, Redeemer, Impact, Light, Medic, Armor. Scorcher no longer makes you commit self-Sudoku implosion when you shoot it too close to something. Point blank, shoot the ground, you don't die if you're max HP. Bug jumps at you, shoot it, you don't die if you're max HP. You still take damage, and it's sizable if you don't have any explosive resistance, but before it was a death sentence. That change is awesome. Um, This could be sketchy yeah it looks it looks a bit sketchy but sometimes sometimes it's not a giant bug nest it's a smaller one and it's either a bug nest or we're gonna be it can't be a spore spewer because those would be like you wouldn't be able to see two feet in front of you sometimes at least not at least not often in the distance and we have the young shrikira hotel on the left side and maybe spore on the right side Cancel that. I probably won't be able to hit that. I'm out. That is so high. That is so high. That's more than 500 meters away. It's gotta be. Giant bug nest supply. Giant bug nest supply thing goes inside. I wasn't playing that as it happened, but we'll take it. I'm holding the high ground here for a bit. Try to trigger the spew, but not die in the process. Was successful, but sometimes you just don't get hit at all, or you get like slowed. There, I almost got destroyed. Those guys were just locked in place. You're weak. Later, bud. If only you get like create a crater here. So what happens is it's not only really staggering chargers, it's flinching them and also giving a bit of steering lock. Steering lock in the sense that they can't turn as easy when you hit them with an arch a uh, arc thrower shot. But it doesn't last that long though. So you can stun you can flinch lock them a bit and steering lock them a bit. But it's not as crazy as you might think. The Hunter and the Wilbers, they grouped up and it was critical. It was so, so, so unfortunate. I was a stalker. I was dead no matter what. Is that... Can Stalker Nest be that small? They're usually like a lot larger in... Like space they take up and whatnot. I guess I can be. See, with the Guard Dog Rover in this, I can take out the things that are bigger that the Guard Dog Rover has a hard time handling and it handles all the small dudes.
I think they reduce the damage it does to you, which is fantastic. Great big fan of that. Okay, this one worked out. I've been getting stuck on those. If you aim at a certain spot on a stalker, you can one-shot them, but the arc thrower is just a little inconsistent. You see, okay, that wasn't even a thing at all, but they usually look like that. They have like the weird coating and whatnot. Enemy tactical asset within range. I'm busting out the scorcher. It's faster for killing up close. Or to stalkers. Close-ish. Okay, so I am doing this a little weird. In hindsight, it's a good thing that I did the bug nest, the big bug nest, and I landed there. Because doing that at the end, you could die, and that kind of sucks. Do they always spawn heavy nests near the extraction? Because for the new AT, AT, the new AT, AT walkers, you're kidding me. I got two sets of freaking Shakira nests. For so the new AT-AT -AT walkers, they tend to spawn near extraction points. So actually, they spawn on extraction points a lot, in my experience. Bug hole south, 300 meters. Now. Okay. One Shakira nest is fine. But having a, like two or three is ridiculous. There's a lot of nonsense happening. I don't mind that bug breach happening there. It's more advantageous. Say hello to democracy. And I'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of it and handle this question mark. I mean, that worked out pretty freaking well. The nuke got everything. Kind of lucky. There's so many hunters. My absolute nightmare. Hunters may slowly fade into being a, a recurring nightmare for me. It'll become my new, like, just my new sleep paralysis demon. And I find that to be a little unhealthy. Okay, luckily, they got lost. I'm out. It feels like you're gonna miss, but you, but you don't miss because they're that far away. It trips me up every single time. Alright, for this, I'm staying here in hopes I can activate it again. Do this, actually. Because that way, if worse comes to worse, do a little stroll by. I can actually, I can hit the up switch and be gone. Can be done with it. Hunters can jump through walls. Just be aware. It's kind of sketchy, but it does happen. What the? The way... It, it looked like a stalker, the way he rolled up like that. I'm telling you, they're bold. Hunters have become emboldened.
Like, they walked up with, like, a macho, macho stride and everything. And that's what I mean. If things were going bad, I could hit that button and be gone. One step closer to mission completion. They could do the young bug reach here. So I wasn't thinking that rock would stop you. It would have been cool if it did, though. Okay. If you stagger it correctly, I think you can sidestep it. You see how it just goes in a straight line like that? That is a young stagger at play. Mission at 30 minutes Guys, remaining. leave me alone right quick. Looking for a breach. Looking for a breach. Ah, uh, never mind. That means they're going to breach over here. That whole time, I think the moment that bug breach ended, the objective ended, I should have done an eagle rearm. I'm just really bad about doing it in the first place. Like, it is genuinely a problem. Because the eagles are really good. They just required a little bit of forward think for a little bit of forward thinking. Nothing crazy. But I mean I guess it's crazy for me. Bug spotted. To That is on me, but I'm alive. That was a hundred percent on me. My gun should be reloaded. I don't mind a bug reach over here. I want to run this way a bit. That nest is still alive. I wonder what I didn't break. Alright, send a rock. Buy some time. Kill charger. Jammed. The timing is impeccable. I'm going to go ahead and hit up this here. See, if I didn't break those bug nests, I think this is close enough to actually get smoked by them. This is where I would use my thing for the mission. It's pretty important. It's called a mission stratagem. I would put that right here. This is where I put that. But I can't. I wonder why. But people are often confused when folks say to use your stratagems. Because sometimes they try their hardest and they just can't. I... Oh my goodness.
I mean, I'm going. It's going pretty well, all things considered. Wilbur. Luckily. I threw these somewhere. I forget where exactly. You can sometimes kill him by doing that. He just wasn't weak enough, I guess. Actually, kind of yeeted my gun a bit. There's a lot going on here, guys. What can I say? I guess I just got really unlucky with enemy pathing and whatnot. I do this. It should kill the charger. Eh, close. Hunters are more dead than Battle Titans. Make it make sense. Okay, well... <laughs> this has been interesting, I tell you what. Just a little interesting. I think it's still going good, all things considered. But that kills it. Cool. Tagging map. Down. 100 meters. The broadcast tower in Narnia. I can't even see it from over here. Dropping a pin. Southeast. That's a little unfortunate. We still have the bug breach we have to do for the actual objective. Fun fact. I could have placed that in a better spot. If I fin them off, then I can hit the button and leave. Oh, it was a nice. Nice bug breach. There was like nothing crazy. He just took 1.21 gigawatts to the dome skis and said, Please, sir, may I have some more? How was that fire? You're kind of blocking some stuff that is important to me. And I have missiles here that could probably, you know, change the narrative. I'm out. That was a face shot. Liberty returns locked and loaded. Disagree slightly. You see, sometimes it dies, and sometimes it doesn't. And now, I gotta get the long melee attack. Like that, to actually shoot it. This is why I take anti-tank. Without it, I don't see how you kill a Bile Titan in any meaningful time with Dark Thrower. Which is fine, I'm just, just how it be. But my guy's already dead to rights, so and I can't kill it fast. Thank you. Tactical asset near your location. Oh, 
I'm trying to stop a bug breach from happening. What are they planning? I wasn't quite sure. Deploying equipment package. There's a thing there? Deploying support weapon. If I'm good with the nuke, I can get all of it with one. I, I can the nuke can hit everything. Not from here though, I don't have the distance. Not yet. Not yet. Where is the other bug nest? Illegal broadcast tower, maybe? I think I kind of see it. That didn't make it. Wrong direction. Wow. Mission map updated. Oh, the charger ran up there, it'd be awesome. You get stuck, I think. It didn't get the bug hole. What do you mean, brother? That was it. Wait. It did. What? I'm perplexed and confused. So that's the other Shakura Hotel. You see, the Guard Dog Rover is basically like a cluster bomb, except you kind of just equip it and forget it. And they can both kill you. Although, there's a chance the Garbag Rover won't kill you as easily. Messed up his steering. Doug Nash. Guns not reloaded. Yes, sir. That's me. That has super samples, but I don't really... I don't need them, so... Yeah. But, when you're playing the game, always go for super samples. There's no point in not... Oh, please don't be another giant bug nest. Isn't that, like, impossible? I have two nades. I think I need more than two nades to handle whatever needs to be handled over here. Stay there and watch. Perfect. You see, I'm like, I'm just keeping its charge going the same direction. That's what you can do with the, the arc thrower now. I want to say charge rifle. I'm not sure why. But it is dangerous. You can mess it up and then, you know, die. It was just one. I was being griefed beyond belief by a single thing. And how far away is that? Okay. 300 meters. At around 150 to 160, to be generous, 180. It sends out the uh, bu -bu -bu bugs. Now I am simply going to grenade this. And this charge is going to chase me. Take the high ground. It can't charge if it has no LOS of actually hitting you from the ground. So you just do that and free. Sending down support weapon. That's gonna alert them.
Bug Reach. Bug Reach, do it. Somebody. Thank you. This bug breach will buy me, hopefully, a lot of time. Because I still haven't done the main objective yet. Which isn't a big deal, because I still have a lot of time to make it out. But... I'm so used to the charge. Grenades. I just want grenades from there. I need to get better about this eagle rearm nonsense. Second time, I could have just had it been going as I'm just running away. If I'm, if I'm just running away from stuff, it makes no sense not to do it. It didn't even get everything. That sucks. Real bad. Hunters, got a conversation. Y'all be cheating a little bit. That worked out. Ever so slightly. Let me run, let me run, let me run, 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 let me run, let me run. So, so troll. Do I have my stuff or did I use it? Like a slight dent. Things are going better until right now. I got hit by a random slow, and the charger destroyed me. I could have maybe dodged, and I probably should have dodged. In hindsight, I definitely should have dodged. But, oh well. Downhill, you don't want to walk, you don't want to walk in a straight line. Both Titans will kill you instantaneously. I should be able to do that from there, no? I think they nerfed the damage on that, and it's amazing. I, I do believe that Guard Dog Rover's damage got nerfed to the player, which is a massive buff. Sir, I, you just need to do one thing. It's, it's called dying. If you just die, it'd be awesome. Flipper, chill. You see, this is why. <laughs> Sir, I just need you to die. Please. Oh my god, just die, bro, please. 
I could nuke it, but I don't want to waste a nuke. I'm I'm attached to it deeply. I should have nuked it. I just kind of had faith. When you shoot a hunter, they should die to the scorcher in one shot. There should be no like, oh, it broke a leg. I shot it in the leg, which is so close to its face. No, oh, good thing. Stop. Good thing is it didn't summon anything too crazy from that bug breach, which is awesome. Where? Sending down equipment package. That stops you, right? Of course not. Kind of makes sense. I feel like I saw it happen before, that's so why I asked that question. I was like, I've seen this before. Maybe it's a different um, mission, so it has different physics. I do want to try the incendiary shotgun, thinking of... Because as I've, I've, as I've been playing the Arctur a bit more against the bugs, I've noticed that the Scorcher is fun and good, but I would probably use Scorcher for a weapon that didn't have the insane sustain that this gun has. Or I'd use, I'd use um, Scorcher with a gun, like a support weapon that I'm using to help me clear hordes. So it would like change roles a bit. Battle Titans are weird, man. The laser's going so crazy. Thank you. Thank you very much. I wonder if you can kill a Battle Titan by shooting the uh, the butt with the Scorcher. I shot the green bits, but I think that the main damage there was actually shooting the, the butt. That is actually the more ideal bug breach to be happening. Have a taste of democracy. That is the most unideal jammer in the world. Okay, not, not, probably not the most unideal. There's been worse. Now, when you break the spit, here's what's going to happen. You're not going to have the easiest time lining up a nuke or a, a KG, whatever you're, whatever you're calling, bro. Um, I may have given it illegal height. Um, hope y'all enjoy. Just spit.
Okay, like I got lucky, sure. But still. This has been a stressful mission, I tell you what. Oh my goodness. I like Arc Thor. I do. I think in a group setting, it's fantastic, as the game's meant to be played. Yada yeah, yada. Yeah, yeah. Speaking of that, though, when folks say team game and or co-op, that doesn't mean you're supposed to play co-op. There's games that are solo and co-op. This game isn't exactly intended for that, but I would argue there's some things this game intends for players to do that aren't exactly good for the game. I'd argue that. Like, people are getting so mixed up, and they've been getting mixed up a lot on, I guess, intention in games and how things change. I guess an example is Apex. Tap strafing. When that was discovered and became really mainstream, the dev said in a tweet, we're going to remove this. It's not fair to anyone. We have to get rid of this. It is unreadable movement, which is true. And so they want to get rid of it. And then, lo and behold, it's still in the game, and they reverted that decision because people loved it, and it gave the game more variance. It gave it content. So, even though the devs didn't intend for it, it turned out to be a good thing, even after they said they didn't like it. They changed their minds. So, I think that people, they're just... You can't be a gosh darn sheep, dude. You gotta think for yourself a bit. If you think if you think with the herd, you, you'll always just be a sheep. And that's just, that's, it's a sad reality. You see it too often these days on the interwebs. Just everyone thinking the same, saying the same stuff. It's crazy. I would like to call us in, so if I die, which is likely, I don't lose. I, I, I want to win this. It may not seem like I want to win, but I want to win. It's important to hit the follow-up shots on the charger, that way it keeps going the same direction you want it to go. Oh, I'm out of stims. I didn't know I was out of stims. I was not aware of the being out part. Do you? Terrible nuke. Wait. Amazing nuke. I'm different. What can I say? Hunters are so broken! Who designed these, brother? They weren't always like this either. That's the craziest part. Y'all made them crazy for no reason. They're scarier than Bile Titans. That is ridiculously goofy, brother. He's phasing through the ground. Him too. That's different though. Last reload! The amount of times a hunter's killed me in the past hour or two is ridiculous. They got the freaking range headshot from deep. The range attack, little tongue kiss, 
and it can slow you, and it can do the double tap as well. It's the scariest mob in the game by far. And I could have, I could do this again and go for an, an evac, but this is good enough for now. I feel like it was educational enough. It was, it, it was good. I think it was good. Didn't complain too much. Cause I could have. Oh, you best believe I could have. Bugs feel worse than the bots because the bugs feel buggy. Full stop. Like bugs are harder than bots. And Arc Thrower is not very good against Battle Titans. Even with the PS5 glitch, which I think is still in the game. I haven't checked recently after the recent patch. It just, you can't choose where it shoots. It's fun to use though. I think it's pretty chill. I think next time I won't use Guard Dog Rover. I would have done Cluster Bombs, but I just figured, I don't know. I just didn't want to. Now, next up, I'll probably do Incendiary Shotgun with a Flamethrower. Actually, now. Nah. Incendiary Shotgun with Guard Dog Rover. We'll see what happens. Anywho, thanks for watching. Have a good day. Peace.